Well, I drove an hour and a half to find out that this place has totally flooded out. Uh, somewhere over there in the middle of that flood, that's where the Kaylee claim is. Or Kaylee or Keeley. It was at this moment Jeremy realized he's but, uh, not getting yeah, in there today. It's deep underwater. So there ain't no getting to this creek today. Because it's, uh, yeah, it's pretty freaking wide. See if I can zoom in on that. Yeah, there ain't no finding no gold out there today. So, back over to the other old claim. Sorry. Hello and welcome. I'm Jeremy Cantor and this is Ohio Prospecting. And uh, as you can see, I'm back at this claim. As you've seen in the video, the other claim that I went to this morning was flooded. So yeah, I'm back out here and uh, the floods have definitely redeposited some material. So with any luck, we should find some gold today. And uh, I brought some new tools to the arsenal this time besides my high banker. Now we'll properly be able to clean up the bottom of the holes. Brought my hand sucks and dredge that I, I made out of my other one. So yeah, let me get running and get to it. And let's see if we can find some gold today. Okay, so I decided to do a little clean out here. So I noticed there was a lot of black sand starting to build up in there. And a lot starting to streak out in the tailings. So I'm gonna do a little clean out here. And uh, yeah, and we'll run some more. Got Jonathan down there. He's down there between the boulders. He's uh, digging dirt now. He was using the hand dredge. But I'm gonna dig this down and I'm starting to hit the boulders that are all down between here, sitting above the clay. And some of them are pretty good sized boulders and I'm gonna use the hand dredge to clean around them so I can try to move them out of the way and get down to that clay layer. And hopefully we'll have a little bit of a better of an outcome this time using a hand suction dredge. Well, hand dredge. <laughs> I dismembered, dis, eh, dismembered the top of my hand dredge for that one. And it seems to work just perfect. So yeah, let me do this clean out, get running a little bit more. And I'll be back with you guys in a bit. Okay, so I think my hole is starting to get deep enough in there. <laughs> I should be getting pretty close to where I want to be in the hole. So I'm going to get the 
hand pump and the bucket and we're gonna clean up that bottom of that hole as best as I can and run it through see I'm getting a nice tailing pile and there's a big old sand pile over there yeah a lot of sand in between all that gravel <laughs> well we're gonna hand uh, hand pump out the bottom run it through the through the high banker and uh, see if we can get anything out of that then we're gonna go back down this way over to where the rocks are right there and we're gonna hand dredge a little bit more so let me set you up we'll do some dredging Got a rock stuck. Be right back. Okay, so I'm on my fourth or fifth final cleanup. Can't remember which one I'm on. <laughs> Just been pretty busy. And uh, this is from down there at the, the big boulders on this side where my finger's at. And I'm going to collect it into the bucket. Which I better hurry up and do so before that thing tips over. It is full. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna get this cleaned up and I'll see you guys back at the house. Okay, so now you know this part. So how did me and John Boy do? Not too bad. A little bit chunkier this time. Some decent flakes. And a little bit of the tiny specky stuff. We'll let it dry up here and we'll do a little bit of a better close up. So did the hand pump work for me? Yeah, I would say so. Definitely got a little bit of the chunkier stuff off of the bottom. So I'll definitely be using that a lot more in my arsenal as I uh, go out to the creeks for now on. And check it out everybody. Here's the Jeremy's Challenge Bag and here's everything that's been added into it so far and man is it heavy. <laughs> and uh, yeah we're going to take the essential stuff out like the pay dirt and uh, the stickers and stuff and get it sent out to Lieutenant Littenman. And uh, get the challenge sent over to him. And uh, yeah, let's see how he does. Because I'm going to leave the rest of the stuff here so that way, uh, you know, it saves me and him on the shipping cost because I have no idea what it's going to cost to ship this out to Germany. So yeah, it's going to be fun. I can't wait to see the challenge though. It's going to be cool. Okay, so. Let's get a close up on uh, Ohio Gold and see what it looks like. Pretty nice. I'll pant, try to keep it still as I can. Oh, let me focus in here. There we go. Hard to do when you move it around.
<laughs> and that pair looks like kind of like a pair of sunglasses. <laughs> Pretty nice though. Zoom you back out. And uh, I'd like to thank you all for joining me. Make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you out there back on the next adventure. And yeah, I didn't expect that uh, flood to happen on the first claim that I went to. But yeah, you'll have that. Alright, see you later.